Welcome to Capital Events. I'm Craig Carper. The General Assembly has passed a bill that would prohibit local governments from acquiring contractors to provide compensation or benefits above the state or federal minimum wage. Democrats tried to adjust the bill to require a $10.10 minimum wage for public procurements, though Democratic Lieutenant Governor Ralph Northam ruled the amendments not germane to the original bill. No one has requested this bill. Somebody just doesn't like the fact that several jurisdictions are doing this. And there's no reason for us to put a block on any other government. If those local citizens don't like that policy, they can show them the door at the next election. Republicans say the bill prevents the artificial inflation of the price of business contracts. It's because the small businesses can't afford to get these jobs anymore in those localities because of these policies. It squeezes the mom and pop contractors out of the market. It costs jobs for the very people that we are supposed to be trying to help. The bill narrowly passed the Senate on a party line vote 21 to 17 after being overwhelmingly approved in the Republican dominated House 67 to 30. For Capital Events, I'm Craig Carper. Broadcast of Capital Events is brought to you by the Medical Society of Virginia. Physicians working together to improve health care in Virginia. MSV.org.